ever pondered the meticulous process forensic scientists employ to analyze minuscule fragments of evidence found at a crime scene? The answer lies in the intricate science of mass spectrometry, a technique different isotopes associated with an element. Mass spectrometry, an analytical tool of paramount importance in fields such as chemistry, biochemistry, pharmacy, and medicine, plays an instrumental role in many scientific investigations. From analyzing combinatorial libraries, sequencing biomolecules, exploring single cells, to examining objects from outer space, mass spectrometry is an all-encompassing method. It aids in the elucidation of unknown substances lights, and ensures the quality control of drugs, foods, and polymers. Diving into the principle of mass spectrometry, it is an analytical method used for determining the mass-to-charge ratio of molecules in a sample. These measurements can also help determine the exact molecular weight of the sample components. It's fascinating to think that it indirectly helped to prove the existence of isotopes. The principle of mass spectrometry is grounded in Newton's second law of motion and momentum. It utilizes this property of matter to plot ions of varying masses on a mass spectrum, showing how mass is related to the inertia and acceleration of a body. When applied to mass spectrometry, Ions with different mass-to-charge ratios are deflected by different angles in an electric or magnetic field. A mass spectrum, a graph obtained by performing mass spectrometry, shows the relationship between the mass-to-charge ratio and ion signal. The process involves an inlet system, ionization, a deflector, and an ion detector. At different deflections, a detector counts the number of ions. The data are plotted as a graph or spectrum of varying masses. Detectors work by recording the charge or current produced when an ion hits or passes through a surface. To generate a spectrum, the signal is significantly amplified. Once ionized, the ions are sorted and separated according to their mass-to-charge ratio. A variety of mass analyzers are available, each with trade-offs related to operation speed, separation resolution, and other technical criteria. The mass analyzer often works in concert with the ion detection system. In mass spectrometry, a quadrupole is used to determine the chemical by calculating the typical mass fragments formed by the ionization of the material. Test molecules are ionized by an electron beam, and the resulting molecular ion and component ions travel into a mass analyzer where their masses are measured. Considered the benchmark for the identification of unknown organic chemicals, mass spectrometry is highly sensitive and selective, with mass spectra easily searchable against vast reference databases. Mass spectrometry instrumentation consists of four primary components, the ionizer, the mass analyzer, the detector system, and the data and manipulation system. In conclusion, mass spectrometry is a vital analytical tool in various scientific fields. It's a method that allows for the determination of the mass to charge ratio of molecules, the creation of a mass spectrum, and the identification of chemicals. By using this tool, Scientists can delve deeper into the unknown and continue to expand our